Hi there, welcome back to the culture beyond, where we are waiting to transform even our tomb worlds into machine worlds. Let's go. Jenna Secundus is a great world with a lot of output and we're going to terraform it to a machine world as well. Our assist to Maton. Doubled up. Let's continue this. Uh, we are using our great Dyson Sphere to expand and expand and it's going to be expanded even more soon. And then we will probably start the Sentry Array as subscriber has convinced me that it is the best choice at this point. What we can do is uh, calculate again how many uh, how many organics do we have, how many people do we have in total. That is something we want to look at. We have 542. And uh, let's see how many, how many are um, organics still? Humans. We have a lot of humans. 172. And we have one Kunistian, that's 173. Jessica Vaz, that's uh, 185. And Quiptiliums, Technological acquisition 199. Successful. 199, we were. Wait. So 199. With the Quiptiliums, then 217 with the Jeskovas, 219 with the Boca Sherens, 219 do we have, and 219 out of 542. Ah, what's 40% what's of 542? There must be something like 200 and... Ooh, that's close again. It's really close again. Let's see. You probably already have it in your head, I guess. But I'm not that quick because it's quite late. 542. Need the exact number. 217 would we need. So, um, we need more organics still to be safe. And now we have, oh, look at that. Ooh. The Jehetma Dominion probably lost like a lot the Sintomoroi, but they have a problem the Lillarobius again. Let's see. So, personality safeguards. Freshly booted personality matrix always runs the risk of descending into madness or unproductive obsessions, resulting in expensive and time-consuming code reductions. But the safeguards will reduce this risk. And what will we go for now? Empire leader capacity. Sapient resource management tool would be good as well. Administrative efficiency, mm, good, but not needed that much. Maybe that, even, even more cost reductions. I don't know. Armies could be good too. I'm at a loss. Hmm. One more leader is just good. Let's go for that, one more leader is nice to have. It's 
not a priority at all, but it shall be good. Hey, Nemozi Prime too. A machine world. We can terraform it back, probably. But we don't want to anymore. This is a machine world. And all our machines are happy to be there. So now that this is a machine world, we could go um, production targets. Is that good? No. But capacity overload might be. No. Not at all. The Jehesmas are going for new options and we might go grand fleet again or map the stars at least map the stars is good united nations of earth ended a migration treaty now they're mixing up they have a problem the the lilarobius They will show them what it's like to lose. Really terrible from the Jehetma. I mean, they they lost so much. It's really incredible. What's going on here? The Quelnudar are entering the space. The Reconquerors. And also, 2400 is nearing, where we might have a crisis coming. <sighs> That's gonna be interesting. And from that influence... I might just go for another construction. Culture construction module is here. What are you doing here? Should be somewhere else. Like in... Uh, I don't know, maybe in Nemozi. How many habitats do we have there? Two. There's room for another, I think. Maybe not here, but on the gas giant. We can build ring worlds now, really? And another science nexus site? What? Another Dyson Sphere site? Something is wrong here. Something's really, really wrong. I mean, we could move this way. Let's have a look at the Dyson Spheres. Still building. I mean, if we can, we can, right? Uh, where should we go? Probably Xir would be a good place. Might as well build, an, build a mega structure here, the Ringworld site. Yeah, we cannot. 
All right, all right. Then mm, we'll redub you. Con structural. And now, oh, give me something. Order, let's go to Nemozi and build that mega structure there. So much influence, it's just needed. Hey, Yelbarasta habitat is complete and ready for colonization. Which is something we'll do. Will not be a research one. It will be a standard one with organics. We'll build another habitat here, so we have that going already. We can already build another colony ship in this place. Let's see from the strategobot, maybe. Planetary settlement procedure initiated. It's time to fill up. <laughs> it's time to fill up. <laughs> Not going to be machine worlds, but they're still good. Science Nexus. Love it. Your, go your war is going exceptionally well, even against the freaking Mechazo multiplex. They're only equivalent, though. I guess they lost. Huh? I guess they lost. Good for the state of machine intelligence. Complete. Scientific module. Yeah, we need two names for the assistomaton and for his module. We're at 25k again, so everything's nice. And hey, another tomb world can be terraformed. Let's look at the surface. Everything is so fine. Let's terraform the organic tomb into a machine world. We have uh, museums still going there for the remembrance of what happened to the organics on that planet. And we're leading our pets, um, our biotrophies there. 
so they learn why it is so good. The culture beyond cares for them. Ah, more and more machine worlds getting ready. Either Drake. Also Oxidon. I'll go Rab. Trimus Secundus and Trimus Prime. Everything's going to be transformed. And David back up one has leveled up. Nice. And now. We could go to other planets even, to maybe to Romanox Prime. Uh, or maybe not yet. To Philomere, to Shrubbery. Not anymore, probably. Romanox would probably be a good choice. So you can start the terraformation now. And we'll bring we'll bring the organics over to the how many are they? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's still okay. Let's let's bring them to the new orbital. That shall be good. Mineral production is quite good enough to to be able to build orbitals and at the same time expand the Dyson sphere. What are we going to do with so much energy? Huh. Jenna Primes terraformed into a machine world. Very nice. I think it's time to contact the curators again. The screeching Abyss. Can you aid us in our research? Thank you. What else? One of their scientists. How much would that cost? It's okay. It would be interesting to have him here in the labs. Maybe when we get another leader access. We'll also have a curator and can study him. Maybe we can make him a pet as well. Of course, there are certain systems where you don't want a ring world, which is screeching abyss, because there is a curator enclave. Hmm, that's worth a thought. Send the Eiffel Builder over to the screeching abyss. Can we go for a mega structure there? build around the star Systems cannot be built complete <sighs> otherwise ring world of course but uh, Rabinok. Yeah, there are a lot of systems that can still have some habitats. 
like here actually trimmers what is that trimmer six there can be another habitat And we will resend there the strategic bots. Things are getting more and more crazy by the hour. There we go, Yelba Rasta settlement. And what did we want to send there? We wanted to send from, I think, Gromonox. Yes, we will send. The newest is further down there. Just move all of them over. and give them leeway to do what they want. Quite costly, but needed. So Romanox Prime can become effective. And what we need to do then is instantly decide what to build where and why. So it seems like we need some nutrient paste facilities there. That's the first. Call of all the bonuses, and then we'll we can build farm bots there. One, two, and three, and. Uh, Four. We can exchange you two. And then we'll go for minerals. Or something else. Let's see. What do we have? A spare parts depot. Would maybe be good first. Yes, spare parts depot and planetary shield generator. Yeah, we'll actually cancel these farm bots. We'll build a prop here second. Will we build just our standard individual, I think? Or the Strategio Bot 2.0. Yeah, that's good. Then a the couple of farm bots. And then another strategic bot 2.0. And then we're fine. And here... Um, probably a spare parts depot, no. A laboratory complex might be nice. Nice, really good. So, thank you for watching. And happy gaming to you. Next time we'll witness a lot of machine worlds coming again. And uh, we'll drive ourselves into a future beyond comprehension, probably, when we see the might of the Istran. 
Thank you for watching and happy gaming to you. The culture beyond loves you.